talk to you today. Pleased to meet you. Thank you very much Hello. for the time today. Um, so first of all, um, welcome to Tokyo. Thank, Thank you. you. Is this your first time? It is indeed, yes. Yeah. Right, so did you have much time to sort of explore and do, do something? Not as yet. We've, we've kind of been around where we're staying, the part we're staying in, and the gigs have kind of been yeah. the priority first of so, all. So we yeah. get some time off, don't we? Yeah, yeah. So far it's been like from one taxi to the other, the gig taxi gig taxi <laughs> yeah. but uh, we're hoping towards the end of our stay that we're we'll, going to get we'll, to see some of Tokyo we'll yeah. certainly make time to discover yeah. a few things right. so what's on your list you know what, what, what to do in Tokyo before you head back to the UK well we'd like to see some of the sort of older side of Tokyo you know some of the uh, I know they've recreated some of the old temples and things like that mm -hmm. and some of the gardens and, and whatnot in Tokyo so we'd love to see that um, and just in general just sort of embrace the culture of the city you know. So obviously you're here for music. Yeah. Um, could you um, just introduce yourself uh, briefly? Who you are? You know what musical instrument you're playing, and um, where yeah. you're from in England yeah. as well. Well, my name's Neil Sheesby, and I play bass in the band. And uh, I'm from a place called Addison in Warwickshire, which is right in the centre of England. And my name's Neil Jones, and I play uh, guitar, and I also sing. And I'm from Warwickshire as well. Uh, just it's, it's right next to Birmingham, basically, where we live. That's the, the, the major city. I see. I see. Yeah. yeah I, um, I I I read you know your um, website, and uh, you, yeah. you, I think you wrote that you were looking for someone who can sing. Okay. Oh me, yes, I was. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, it's, well, we've been forming a band. Yeah, yeah well, that was a long time ago. We were, we were, we've been friends for 15 years or so. But yeah, when we're looking to piece the initial thing together, that was the first thing I wanted to do when I wanted to form a band was find a singer, because at the time, you know, I think that was something that was really neglected. There's a lot of good songs, but there's no great singers. And Neil had played in a band previously that supported one of my old bands. It just knocked me out. You know, blew me away. So we become friends, and then we just started hanging out, playing records, and starting to find a band. It took a long time to get the music, right musicians to get the, to create the sound that we had in our heads really to get the right combination of people that understood the vision as well yeah that's how it began really yeah no I instantly fell in love with your voice you know how oh, you thanks, sing. Mate. and that's that's probably you know represents you know um, song foundation yeah um, but um, so my favorite song is no mother thought by the way oh very good uh, thanks <laughs> very that's a really good life song isn't it yeah yeah, yeah. Um, so anyway, how do you describe, you know, Stone Foundation? Because I, I find it, it's, it's kind of hard to describe. It is funky, you know, it's rock sometimes, it's jazzy, it's blues. Yeah. Well, I think because there's a lot of us as well, I think it's a melting pot of ideas yeah. and influences. We're both, we're both me and Neil, we're, we're more, first and foremost, we're real music fans. We've got big record collections. So uh, I guess a lot of that spills over yeah. into the sound. Everyone, everyone kind of brings their own little thing to the table. So, you know, there's elements of jazz, in what we do, soul, um, you know, maybe a little bit of funk in there, you know, there's all sorts of things that we throw in um, and which creates the sound and I think it's it's quite a unique sound, it pulls on like a lot of roots music and stuff that we listen to, but it kind of creates that Stone Foundation sound. You know? mm -hmm. Brilliant, so it's quite original isn't it, really? Yeah, I think it, like Neil says, I think that combination, that melting pot does make it unique and we're very conscious not to just be pastiche or we're want to bring something new to it so you know we're trying to make our own little little turn on it our own little mm. slant on, on, on kind of modern British soul music really yeah oh, I see, I see. so lastly obviously you were here because of Visit Britain's campaign yes music of course is great. Yeah. yeah yeah and UK's music is great that's that's like obvious fact yeah uh, what I'd like to ask you uh, now is that what's um, great for you so I'd like to fill in something is great and uh, give me the reason why. Okay, to do with music in our um, country and, and or anything like anything is fine. Like cup tea is great. Like, <laughs> oh well, there you go. That's my favorite thing. I'm addicted to tea. <laughs> so could you sort of like you know um, um, choose one great one thing you? from our country that yeah, we well, find yeah. great. From, yeah. from England. From England is probably yeah. It's good. Okay, I've I've got one yeah, instantly. Yeah, thank you. So if I uh, can I pass you that and straight straight away it's the the one thing that we we love outside of of music. I can't write. I'm struggling. 
So there we go. We all love that. That's that's football is great. Is. Well, we do argue about that. That's one thing we, we do argue. argue about. He's Man United. I'm Leeds United. You see, so that's a bit chuck right. and cheese. That, that's that's as near to religion as you can get without getting religious. Yeah. Right, right. Brilliant. Okay. So what, what's uh, what's great for you, Paul Neil? Um, there we go. Style is great. With that, I mean, youth cultures. I mean, we, we kind of we had the, the, the modernist movement, whether it's rockers or punks or anything. I think that the youth culture has always been predominant in in the UK, and I think uh, that gets picked up on in, in in countries like Japan, where they actually follow it to the ninth degree and have a real attention to detail. But I think style's always been important, and clothes have always been a big part of our culture, and that's yeah. ongoing. I think people have always like kind of looked towards England for the next kind kind of thing, you know, and it's, it's really interesting to us from last night's gig how many Japanese guys turn up with the mod look and, you know, the punk sort of style, that kind yeah, that, of thing. That, last night's gig was the best dressed audience we've ever played to. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, good, yeah. it's a good style here and it kind of, you guys take that style but then you make it your own, you don't just copy it, yeah, that's you right. know, exactly, and, uh, and we find that really cool. Oh, nice, nice, so. nice. Okay, so just, just, like, uh, just to finish the interview, so uh, you knew all is coming soon, right? Yes. It's yeah. March. March the 10th, yes. Right. What, what to expect, you know, from the new album? Uh, basically, uh, the new album, we've been really fortunate. We've got some wonderful um, featured artists on there as well, people that gave up their time for us. Uh, people like Carleen Anderson, uh, Andy Fairweather Lowe from Amen Corner, uh, Nolan Porter, who's a great old soul singer, Horace Panther from The Specials designed the artwork for the record as well. And we really think it's probably the best piece of work that we've put together, you know. it's uh, It almost feels like... Yeah. Something that we were building up towards for the last three or four years yeah. together, yeah, that, um, yeah. and it's got it's got to that peak now. And we really think that we've created something really good, really positive in its uh, in its message as well to find the spirit. It's a real positive album. Right, I quite like the uh, jacket. You know, I uh, yeah the jacket. sleeve. That was the, again that was obvious from the specials that painted that. Yeah, wow, yeah, it's yeah right. very pleased with it. Mm. Yeah. So um, as as a, as a fan, you just listen to the new album and. Uh, expect you to come come back to Tokyo, maybe. Yes, yes. We'd like to do that. Yeah, we'd, we'd very yeah. much like to do that. Hopefully, you know, maybe, maybe in a year's time or something. But we'd like to get back as soon as possible. Brilliant. Yeah. Uh, good luck on your gig tonight and tomorrow. Thank, and you, thank you very, very much. much. Thank Cheers. you very much for your time. Thank, thank you. you. Thanks, thank you. Thanks, mate.